Hi, I'm Ben Lucas from Nom Creative, and I'm a professional photographer in the Seattle area. And this is Mary. She is not a photographer. Mary is actually a paid actor. Today, we have a few people coming in, and we're going to see with the same lighting, same camera, same everything, the only difference is us, if they can tell the difference between a fake and a full-time photographer. How hard do you think it is to be a photographer? I think it's actually very difficult to be a photographer. At first glance, it just seems like you guys just go over and take pictures. I think that it can be pretty difficult, specifically getting people to relax. That's actually what we're here today to find out. So you're going to have two photographers take your picture today. Uh, are you ready? Could you stand over here on the tape, please? I can do that. Toes in front. Yes, please. Look at me. Okay. Chin up a bit. Say cheese. Cheese. Say cheese. Cheese. Uh, so are you going more for drama or comedy? Um, kind of the mixture. Make sure? I okay. consider myself very fun. Okay. Well, let's, let's see something fun then. Are you married yourself, Ray? Yes, I am. It's been right. uh, 35 years. Oh, wonderful. All right, so go ahead and think about your first date. Oh, uh, my first date. Yeah. That bad, huh? Not, 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 not. <laughs> Do you remember the first time you ever went Tulsa dancing? Any pretty girls there? <laughs> you know, that was the intention. Do you want some headphones or something? I got, got some headphones you can borrow. Headphones. Yeah, sure. Oh yeah, and they sit on like that. <laughs> You've got attitude. Give me a little bit of that attitude. I got swagger. Uh, what, what is your favorite character to play when you're performing? A sexy, slow-moving, lizard-like. So something like a little bit more, more sultry that you're yeah, going for? Enough. All right. What's your favorite magazine? Classical singer magazine. Classical Singer. What, what, what does the cover of Classical Singer magazine look like? Usually like this. <laughs> <laughs> uh, do, you, do you think there was any difference between how uh, I worked and how Mary worked? Well, I think there I think there must be. I haven't seen the pictures yet. Yes, there was. Um, you were very more, you were a lot more personal and it was easier to understand where you wanted to take a picture. The first one kind of was like nothing, no, no help. If you know what I mean, like no one was like saying, oh, you need to kind of move your face this way. But the second one was like really in, into it. We were kind of connecting more. The first photo actually felt more like a DMV picture. When people take your photo, uh, do you get more of Mary type of photographer or more of the me type of photographer? Mary all the time. Like they don't care, unfortunately. Would it shock you at all to say Mary is not a photographer? She's actually a paid actor. No, it's not shocking. Yes, that would shock me because I thought she was a photographer. <laughs> I mean, I know you are, but I thought you had another one. No. <laughs> Boy, no. I've okay. worked with so many photographers, I had a funny feeling. Mm -hmm. Okay, that makes that kind of makes sense. <laughs> oh, I don't know which photo is which. I'm going to show them to you, and Ooh. you have to tell the difference. Are you ready? Yeah, that's really neat. All right, let's see them. Wh which one do you think? Don't look at that one. <laughs> that one's a lot better. I would not want to show that first one. <laughs> I'm thinking immediately untag on Facebook. Yeah, I wouldn't want me to. <laughs> Not my name. What do you think? What do you think? <laughs> um, I'm gonna guess that that was Mary, and that's you. I'd say the one on the right is full time. Would you be happy with either of these photos, or do you like one better than the other? I think I like the one on the right better. Professionals on the right. I think the fake's on the left. Uh, so you are looking for an actor's headshot. Yeah. Would the pro shot get you any callbacks? I think so. I, I definitely think that uh, people will take a second look at my picture from this. Would the fake shot get you any callbacks, you think? Not not as much. Yep. Ben, Mary. What do you think the, the big difference is between the photos here? One shows personality and the other one doesn't. I'm going to think that the one on the right is the one you took. The one on the right looks a little happier. I think the one on the right is the pro. I look more comfortably smiling there. So after this little experiment, if you had any friends that needed headshots, what would you recommend to them? Uh, professional. Professional? What makes you say that? Uh, well, it does look better. Look for someone, I don't know, who cares and will take time with you, I guess. Like, don't just settle on someone who's gonna be like, oh, I got a camera, I can click, and then you're done, and you gotta pay me. If you have any friends that need headshots after this little experiment, what, what advice would you give them? I'd say I know a guy. <laughs> Pretty much everyone here could tell the difference between a professional portrait and a forced cringe. Could you tell the difference? Let me know in the comments. 
You can see more of my work at www.nomcreative.com, spelled nom nom nom, and you can get free photography tutorials. If you like this video, be sure to hit subscribe. It's down there somewhere. Right, right there. Subscribe.